Good afternoon to one and all present here. I am Varshini of class 11 and I have come to deliver my speech on Jai Jawan. Jai Jawan, a widely spelt and eternal slogan, was given by our former Prime Minister Lal Bahadur Shastri in 1965 to boost up the Indian soldiers in the Indian Army. The word soldier stands for soulful, orderly, loyal, dedicated Indians who eternally render their service. In accordance with these words, they are really very dedicated. What do, what do they get out of their dedication? They get nothing but only the injuries and their death. Uh, and their death. Um, they know that they are standing at the threshold of life and death, but they do not bother about it. They come bravely to uh, fight for India and protect the Indians. They, every Indian soldier has their, have their own family, but they are deprived of their family and are let in the extreme places of India where they are suffering a lot. Now we, let us come uh, to women. Uh, women are nowadays equal to men. Uh, nowadays the women are also showing up in the military. Uh, the women showing up in the army had to face many, uh, many and lot of uh, struggles. But they cast out all these struggles and move forward to render eternal service for the uh, for India. But uh, I wonder one thing: why none of them are uh, opting for uh, going to military? This is because we are afraid of ourselves and we are selfish. If we are selfless, we surely go to uh, go to the uh, any places to render our eternal service. Uh, nowadays, the rate of uh, uh, interest in military is decreasing because the students are not aware of it. We need to create awareness about it. The soldiers who are at the borders are not only uh, disturbed by the enemy countries or any other, even nature is cruel to them. They are, uh, they are not sure about their death. They are ev each and every minute, they are doubtful about their life. So, we should be aware of one thing, soldiers, uh, soldier, soldiers life is not like a normal human being's life, it is totally different from everyone's life. So, we should rever them and uh, spread the uh, slogan Jai Jawan so that the pride of Indian soldiers spread everywhere throughout the world. India uh, got independence in 1947, that time India was lacking in all the resources and it was not developed, it was in the uh, list of underdeveloping countries. But one thing was uh, strong, that was the defence in India. Right from 1947 until date, it is very strong and we must make, we must strengthen it so that it will be the strongest in the world in the future generation. Finally, I conclude my speech by saying that we should rever our soldiers and we should be uh, we should be proud that we are Indians and we should render our service to India forever. Thank you.